The government is not happy this evening about the latest moves by the opposition in the National Assembly with their majority. The opposition parties want more clarity and information on government's role and investment in the construction of the new Marriott Hotel. Late Monday in the National Assembly, the two opposition parties, the APNU and the AFC, used their majority to withhold taxpayer funding of the Marriott project, which is already on the way in Kingston here in the city. The opposition's position is that the government would first have to come to the Assembly and seek approval for the funding and not continue along the road of just putting money into the project as it wishes. But even with the opposition's move, the government could and is expected to continue funding. The administration has been pushing for the project for over three years now, and with construction finally on the way, there appears to be no turning back for the government. The opposition parties have been pushing to get more information on the project itself. They want to see a feasibility study as well as economic and environmental assessment reports. The Minister of Finance has now extended an invitation to the opposition parties to meet at the office of the President, where he said they will be provided with the requested documents and information. The opposition, however, believes that since taxpayers' money is being spent, taxpayers ought to know more about the investment, and as such, they want any revelation of documents and information to be made in the National Assembly and not behind the doors at the office of the President. The government intends to spend a whopping 21 million U.S. dollars on the Marriott project, which is being undertaken by a company known only as Atlantic Hotels Incorporated. The opposition wants to know more about that too, and the principles of the company and where that company may be getting its financial support from, other than through loans that are expected to come from the banking sector. The opposition's concern is that the government has not been too forthcoming about the project and the movers and shakers behind it. While some in the private sector have come out in full support of the project, expressing the importance of a hotel like the Marriott for Guyana and the need for such a hotel, few of them have seen information about the investment and the feasibility study. The government of Guyana believes the opposition's moves are selfish and not in the best interest of the country or the tourism industry.